Hi, it's Jake from the Running With Jake podcast, and if you are watching this video, then clearly you are ready to take on your challenge in Cancer Research UK's Race For Life At Home. Now, we all know that just because our races have been cancelled, that does not mean that we have to stop raising money for this incredible charity. And all your money goes to Cancer Research UK to fund the amazing work that those scientists do to combat and beat over 200 types of cancer. But if we are going to kick cancer's butt, we've got to make sure that we are properly warm. And that's what this video is all about. I want to take you through one of my workouts, which is a great little routine, a nice warm-up routine to get you ready before you go and do your own challenge, whether you're at home, whether you're in the garden, or whatever the challenge that might be. I've seen some really interesting stuff in the Facebook group, people doing some runs around the garden, some press-up challenges, squat challenges, even a little bit of twerking I saw from one or two people, which is just awesome, some really inspirational stuff. So let's get you nice and warm. You don't need any equipment for this. I want you to take it at your own level, so I will give you some uh, little ways of revising the movements as you need to. So the first thing I want you to do is find some space, start shoulder width, really simple, we're going to start with the upper body and it's shoulder circles. So just take them back, take the shoulders back, try to get them nice and high towards the ears. So big circles if you can. And it's really important to warm the body up before physical exercise because it reduces the risk of injury because it gets your muscles and joints nice and warm all the way. But the other thing is, it kind of switches the mind on as well. It stimulates the mind ready for the challenge, in your case, that you're about to do. Good, rest it there. Okay, this time we're gonna take into arm circles. So nice and big, reaching to the sky if you're in the garden like me, or to the ceiling if you're in your kitchen or in your lounge or wherever you might be in your house. Okay, and let's go the other way. So really big circles. By now you should feel the upper body starting to warm up a little bit, particularly in the shoulders. Cool, let's go for three, nice and high, two, and again, one, rest it there. Okay, shaking out those arms. Let's take it to the lower body. So this is great, we're gonna start shoulder width, and the first thing I want you to do is a little squat. Now, if you can go quite low, I want you to do that, but just be careful if you've got any problems with the knees or the lower back, stay at your own level. So nice and small if you can, you're gonna plant the seed, and then you're gonna watch it grow. And yes, I did come up with this. We're gonna plant the seed, so nice and low, and then you're gonna reach the sky and watch it grow. That's it, nice and low, nice and high. So you can see I've got lots of joints getting involved in this movement pattern. Elbows, shoulders, knees, hips, ankles, a little bit of the neck, which means that I'm getting nice and warm through all those muscles. The sun's coming out. It's going to be a good day. Okay, let's get three more. So that's three, we're gonna pick up the pace a little bit. Nice and high for two. Last one, straight up, bang. Awesome, okay, rest it out. Let's pick the tempo up a little bit, staying with the legs. Now this time we go quite wide, and if you love planting the seeds, you're gonna love this. This is just ace. <laughs> this is paint the rainbow. I'll show you how it works. So fairly wide if you can, you might feel a little pull on the inside, a little stretch in, uh, on the inside of the thighs there. I want you to take your paintbrush with both hands. You're gonna paint the rainbow and it looks like this. So you go over to one side, and then you're gonna reach nice and high, come back down the other side, and then we're gonna reverse straight over. So really reach, pushing through the legs as you come back up, reaching to the sky and back down. Let's go for it. I cannot wait to hear how you all get on with these challenges at home. I want selfies, I need selfie proof. It's very important in 2020 that we have proof <laughs> using those selfies. So nice and high, good. Okay, let's go for three. Good, really reach guys, all the way up, two, and again, last one, rest it there, top job. Okay, shaking out those legs, staying with the legs. Now, I want you to imagine, stay with me on this, you live in a tiny house, man, it's so small, really low ceiling, so you've got to stay quite low. I want you to stay low under that ceiling. This time you can pop your hands here, and we're gonna get some rotation through the hips by just turning, quarter turn, and then we come back to center. Other way, stay low. Watch your head on that low ceiling, stand up. Give yourself a breather, we go again. So low, open out the hips. And this is a great little routine to put into any of the home workouts that you might be doing through this lockdown period. Okay, facing forwards and back. What do you reckon, three more? I think so. So that's three to center, to center, good. We've got two more to do, stay with me guys. I'd be very disappointed if you're all watching this in your pajamas with a cup of tea, doing nothing. You've got to join in. <laughs> okay, and back to center, 
and we rest it there. Shake out those legs. Okay, final one. Let's have a bit of fun. Let's switch the mind on, stimulate that brain. I want you to forget about any responsibilities you have in life right now. This is all about you and your challenge and raising money for that incredible cause, Cancer Research UK. So, shoulder width again. This time, it's head, shoulders, knees, toes. And yes, it's exactly what you're thinking. I'm gonna call that heads, shoulders, knees or toes, and you're gonna reach for that body part. Now, of course, head and shoulders are very easy, but if we're going for the knees, you've gotta put a baby squat into it. If we're going for the toes, a little bit lower. Now, if you struggle with the toes, just go as low as you can, all right? Stay within your limits. Okay, we'll start easy. Head, shoulders, head, knees, head, shoulders, toes, head, toes, shoulders, head, toes, to head, ah, shoulders, knees, toes, head, toes, toes, head, knees, toes, head, shoulders, head, toes, knees, <laughs> rest it there. <laughs> Give yourself a mini round of applause. Very, very well done, very well done. If you're in the garden like me on your own, you kind of just have to applaud yourself because there's nobody there to do it for you. Absolutely awesome. It's been an absolute pleasure taking you through one of my workouts. Go and be amazing, go and raise money, go and do your challenge. You know why you're doing this. We all know somebody that's been affected by cancer and what you are doing is absolutely awesome, raising money for that cause. So let's stay together. We will beat cancer. I can't wait to hear how you all get on. I'm Jake Lowe. I'm the presenter of the Running With Jake podcast and I look forward to speaking to you all very soon.